it's Janie and welcome to my channel and today I'm going to be showing you a um, twisted silver haul that I did a couple of days ago I ordered online because they were having a sale on their rings all of their rings well not all of them there was probably three maybe four different ones that weren't on sale but the majority of them were on sale for twelve dollars and the reason why they were on sale for twelve dollars was that they are closing them out so that they can um, do new designs. So I thought I would show you what I got. Um, unfortunately, you won't be able to go and order these items, but you can still go on the Twisted Silver website and look at the different items that they have. They have some really pretty jewelry, and I had never heard of Twisted Silver until I watched um, Miss Lola Lynn, um, Lauren, Laura do a video on Twisted Silver. Her and um, Beauty Buzz Hub, Sarah, they both do videos um, with Twisted Silver. Anyway, oh and um, Natalie from Flower Bomb 31 also did a video on the rings that she had. So that's how I heard about it. So if you want, you can go look at that website and then sign up for their emails. So if they do another sale, then you can get on on that. Anyway, we'll get started. I will tell you that the ring sizing, um, they did tell you to order up a size, but the way that they're made, you almost need to order up maybe like two sizes, especially if you're going to be doing on a bigger finger. Anyway, the first one that I have is this one here that I ordered, and I just thought this was so pretty. I thought it would be bigger round like I really like big bold rings so I really thought it would be like pretty bigger and I actually tried to order the size to fit this finger so I ordered a size 8 but it does not see it doesn't even go down I would need like a 10 probably for that finger but anyway that was okay because the dimension here isn't big enough for this finger anyway so it's that one there and I am um, thought that this piece would go good with some of my um, brass looking jewelry that I have, like this piece here that I have on. I just purchased this um, when we went to Branson and this was bought at serendipityofbranson.com. It was a little shop there in one of the little um, shopping centers. I'm going to raise up so you can see it. But basically what it is, it's, it's the face of a pocket watch and then he's put this butterfly on top of it. And I love butterflies. And then it has this um, type closure. I don't know what the correct name of it's called. A toggle. It's a toggle. It's supposed to go in the back, but I just think it's so pretty that I like to leave it here as a decorative piece. But I thought this and this ring would go really good together. Just the kind of metal that it is and the vintage look of it. I just love that. Anyway, that I got this past weekend when we went on our little trip. And like I said, it is at a shop called Serendipity. I have the card right here. It's where I got the necklace, even though this is a Twisted Silver um, video. And it's serendipityofbranson.com. I'll see if I can get that up close enough that you can see the website. And I will... Um, put it in the description box also. I won't be able to link it because I don't know how to link, but I'll at least put the website down. Anyway, so this was this ring and um, let me see, where's my, oh, I am so disorganized. I had the packing slip just a second ago. Oh, here it is, it fell. Let's go see what the name of this ring is. I don't think it really matters because you're not gonna be able to order it anyway. It's called the, um, The bowing ring, I think. Yeah, the bowing ring. But anyway, and then I ordered this one, and this one is called the um, jibe ring, and it looks like this here. Looks like a love knot right here, and I thought this would be really pretty to wear with some of my stainless steel jewelry that I have. And I ordered this in a size eight, which is what the size is here. 
and inadvertently I also ordered it in a size 9. I didn't realize I had ordered two, but I did order two. And it still is kind of tight, see, for that finger. So it definitely would have needed a 10. So this may end up going in a, um, a blog sale. I could wear it on that finger, but I don't really like to wear another ring on this hand because I just like to wear my wedding band on this hand. But anyway, so anyway, this may end up being in a blog sale. Not a blog sale, because I don't have a blog, but just a sale. Anyway, and then the other one that I ordered is this one here, and this one is called the, um, what is this one called? The coil ring? No, that one was the coil ring. This one's the jive ring. And I ordered this one in a size 9 too, thinking I could wear it on this hand right here, but it's just, it's too tight. Ugh, especially if it gets hot. So anyway, it's here. But that is what it looks like there. And it's a little bit more bigger dimension than what the other ones are. But see, they just have really unique pieces, and I love that. I love wearing unique, different, handcrafted type merchandise, jewelry, art pieces. That's it. They're art pieces because they are. It's like wearing a piece of art on your hand. And one thing about this company, what I have heard and learned is that they don't mass produce all of this. They'll make just a, what, maybe like one production of it and then they're done. It's done. They're, they close it out and they move on and do something different. So you're not seeing it lift left and right um, so definitely if you like unique pieces that maybe look like it's something that was um, handcrafted and designed just for you I would check them out twisted silver is the name and it's twisted silver.com and um, they have a lot of pretty necklaces and bracelets and I know uh, Miss Lola Lynn just put up a video of her favorite twisted silver combinations so check out that video because she showcases a lot of really pretty jewelry that they have on there anyway that's it for my twisted silver jewelry haul plus one little piece from serendipity can't wait to go back to this um, this shop and and see what he has in the future he did he was handcrafting some um, pieces that were made out of the uh, mechanical parts of the pocket watch that he showed me what he was working on so next time I go which will probably be about another month or so he should have those made so I can't wait to see what those look at look like and um, kind of talking to him a little bit about maybe doing um, some special pieces for me that are um, bigger so that's what I told him I like really bold unique designs so he said he would see what he could do for me. So I'm really excited about that. Anyway, thank you so much for watching and have a great day.